Hi there, welcome to the Enlightened Super Trade Education Weekly Market Update. So, before I go through and have a look at the markets, um, tomorrow we're going to have a free trading class on how a simple trading technique could increase your trading profits. So, that's the topic. And our agenda for tomorrow's free webinar is simply uh, to give you a very simple trading system that could potentially increase your trading profits. It's a low risk, high probability trade as well, and how to read price action and some QA. And at the same time, why the KISS method always actually works. So that's uh, August 13th from 3 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. That's 6 to 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Alright, uh, that's it for our um, well, reminder. Obviously, also you have how to be a consistent profitable trader. That's August 20th, and how to create a high probability trading system, which is uh, $49 on August 17th from 3 p.m. to 5:30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Okay, let's go through at the Giants Industrial 30 based on the longer term time frame perspective. Okay, you can see here that uh, from my last uh, video, I stated that. We're waiting for a confirmation to create the new pivot point to create a new higher high continuation of that uptrend. So it did. We have a lower high now and a lower low. There's a way too powerful overturn and overrule the three weeks of uh, spinning top and dojis. So the probability that the price of the Dow of within this week that the bears are going to continue is simply around the 15,236 all the way to a good strong demand level which is uh, the 15,000 pretty much 100 error now if they basically break through there what we need here in order for the before the continue continuation of the trend is to see a higher low so for now I'm very bearish with the coming week but obviously overall still pretty much over, very, very bullish can't go against the trend however this is just like I said from last week it's just a minor correction before the continuation of the trend to the upside so if I'm going to play this game within this week is to um, swing trade uh, basically shorting uh, certain trades out there and that could be from the currency perspective, stock perspective, and the futures perspective. Uh, however, longer term though, still very bullish, but once we I see a clear indication, confirmation being part of level demand, and at the same time I can see a higher low, then we can go back in and go along to the markets once again. All right, that's my report for this week. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care until next time. Happy trading, and I look forward to seeing you in class. See you guys. Bye now.